Hello, I'm here today to go over our assignment for class today. We are going to be watching a generation genius on bacteria and viruses. So as you know, the kind of topic or the theme for this week and last week was the characteristics of life. And we've been really talking about and kind of dissecting that question um, about viruses and if, if are they alive or are they not alive? Um, and then bacteria as well. So this is a really great video that we have found um, and then we want you guys to watch. So it's 14 minutes and 20 seconds long. Um, the link is posted right in Google Classroom. So you're gonna be watching this video um, in live time on your own. And then what you're gonna do, um, also posted in the link, um, you're also gonna find a quizzes game that we want you to, or we encourage you to play. Also, the Kahoot, the Kahoot we're going to actually do in class. Um, that's not independent. That's whole group. Um, and then there's also another video that, about viruses and bacteria. So we're really kind of tackling that topic of bacteria and viruses today. So once you get through those games and watch that video, you guys are going to complete a Generation Genius Bacteria and Viruses Google form. So you put your first name, your last name, and when you have science class. And then you're going to answer these questions. Some students prefer to have these questions up and out and open when you are watching the Generation Genius, some people to prefer to do it at the end. It doesn't matter to us as long as it's completed. This is going to be a graded assignment that is going to go in the grade book. So it's very important that you try your best. The grade that you get on this assignment um, or on this Google form will go directly into on course. Um, and like I said, with a lot of the resources um, and activities we've been doing this week, I'm hoping that it's a pretty easy uh, Friday assignment for you. So there's 10 questions in total that you'll need to answer. So once you complete that Google form, watch that video and the, to play the couple review games, you can complete the form. There's also this poll. I just kind of want to see where everybody's at. Our virus is alive poll. Um, and then you'll answer in your opinion, should viruses be classified as living or non-living? In your opinion, why should they be classified as living or non-living based on some evidence? And then what did you learn something from completing this activity? This is really from yesterday's activity and today's activity. So please submit both of those forms. Also, as you know, today is the due date for your Characteristics of Living Things project. So please make sure that is turned in. Um, it is due today. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. And of course, have a wonderful weekend.